have a, a dream in life of being a brewer, um, but I was a home brewer for many years, and uh, I think it's every home brewer's dream to own a brewery, whether they think that they, uh, whether they think they can pull it off or not. I, I started home brewing um, in 2007. After I got into it, I really started to realize that. I was just a creative outlet and there was really endless possibilities. Um, I never really considered myself an artist uh, or uh, being a super creative individual, but after, uh, you know, after brewing different things and uh, just seeing the, the joy that it brought to people and how excited they were to taste something unique in something that I made. Um, uh, I just really started to fall in love with it. I needed to change jobs and was looking for a new, um, uh, a new direction in life. And the right opportunity came along when Kevin sent me a message saying, hey, I hear you make good beer. Ever thought of opening a brewery? Because I'm working on one. Um, there wasn't a brewery in Ketchum. And for a ski town and for such an awesome spot, to not have locally produced beer available, um, just seemed not right and there were a lot of people that felt the same way and it was the right opportunity at the right time um, and uh, you know being young and at that time single it was just kind of like well yeah let's let's go for it and um, so many people regret making though not making those decisions to jump and uh, to try something completely new when they're young and for both of us, it was the right time, and so we decided to go for it. I don't know if it's real, but it's how I feel. Don't know if you really came, but I feel dumb and asking. You should have been an actress, you so domineering. Take two white gold earrings for your troubles, man. When it's looking dark, punch the future in the face. You know, if somebody hasn't tried tried our beer, man, just try it. You know, um, and I really stand by. You know, if the beer isn't what you're looking for, then by all means, don't drink it. Um, find the beer that you're looking for. You can find great beers right here, and you know, really wherever you are, try local beer. Try something new. Find find what you like. You'll never know until you try it. Uh, we, we went out on a limb um, and, and really took a, a bold step and um, uh, it's paying off. Being 30 years old and, and being an entrepreneur in um, what most people would see as a very, very difficult market I think the, the most fulfilling part is when um, I see someone that I don't know, that I've never met, that doesn't know who I am, try my beer and say, yeah, that's, that's good, that's awesome. And, and just to see the, the pleasure and uh, the joy that, that beer brings to people and exactly why people like beer, to see something that I've created provide that opportunity for them. You know, if you have an opportunity uh, to take a reasonable risk and to uh, to follow what you want to do, go for it. I mean, and, and that goes for everything in life. We should be taking responsible risks. We should be trying things. Uh, you know, it was a great risk to take with a great reward for doing it. Uh, so if you have the right opportunity for, for taking um, a risk and, and um, bettering yourself, bettering your life, and, and bettering your community, then, then you should do it. And, and hopefully um, your friends and your community can be behind you uh, in, in supporting you in that. Um, and hopefully you, know, you can just achieve your dreams and, and live a, a more fulfilling life.